Hello and welcome to this tutor to you at Excel A level business video. In this video, we're going to do a 10 mark question walkthrough. The topic is penetration pricing and the context is a sports event. Let's begin by looking at 10 mark questions in general. Now, it's important to remember that all 10 mark questions require you to assess. For example, assess the benefit of internal recruitment to a business such as Sports Direct. In a 10 mark question, it is vital that you produce a balanced response and your answer must have a supported judgment. So in the case of that question, assess the benefit of internal recruitment to a business such as Sports Direct. A possible structure could be a reason why internal recruitment may be beneficial to Sports Direct. We need balance, so we need a reason why internal recruitment may not be beneficial to Sports Direct and we need a supported judgment. Let's look a little bit more closely at the supported judgment. So to secure the higher marks, so the nine and 10 marks in level four, then a supported judgment is expected. And this needs to be more than just a repeat of your preceding arguments. It really needs to add value to your response. The supported judgment should be an overall decision which relates to perhaps the market the business operates in or the products and services of the business, the situation the business finds itself in, or perhaps the objectives of the business. And this is what we mean by MOPS. So on screen are the different descriptor levels for a 10 mark question. So there are four levels, levels one, two, three, and four. Level one, one to two marks. Level two, three to four marks. Level three, five to six marks. Level four, seven to 10 marks. And as we've just seen, you need a support of judgment if you are to get nine and 10 marks. So what we're aiming for is level four. So let's quickly look at the level four descriptor. So in your answer, you need to demonstrate accurate and thorough knowledge and understanding which is supported by a relevant and effective use of the business behavior stroke context. A coherent and logical chain of reasoning showing causes and or effects. Assessment is balanced. You must have a balanced response and well contextualized using quantitative and qualitative information and showing an awareness of competing argument stroke factors leading to a supported judgment. So level four, is what we're aiming for in a 10 mark question. So the context for our 10 mark question in this video is the Great Bristol Run. Feel free to pause the video to spend more time reading through this extract. So the Great Bristol Run is an annual half marathon road running race which takes place on the streets of Bristol. Launched in 2014, it is part of the Great Run series created by former British athlete Brendan Foster. The Great Bristol Run has become one of the UK's most popular mass participation sport events, attracting 16,000 runners from all over the country. The race sells out within months of entries opening, despite there being a few other half marathons not far from Bristol. The Great Bristol Run uses penetration pricing via an early bird offer, with an entry price of £27, which increases to £36 closer to the event date. So our 10 mark question is, assess the likely impact on the Great Bristol run of using penetration pricing, 10 marks. So as we've seen in a 10 mark question, we need a balanced response and we also need a supported judgment. So a possible structure for this question could be, a positive impact on the Great Bristol run of using penetration pricing, a negative impact on the Great Bristol run of using penetration pricing, and then a supported judgment. So please feel free to pause the video now and maybe spend two or three minutes just thinking of a likely positive impact, a likely negative impact, and what your overall supported judgment would be then unpause to run through a suggested response. Okay, let's look 
at the first part of our answer now remember there are lots of different points you could make this is just one of them so a positive impact of using penetration pricing for the great bristol run is that it may help ensure that the event sells out each year Having a lower initial price of £27 compared to £36 may encourage runners who cannot afford the full entry price or may not want to pay the full entry price to enter the race. By encouraging these runners to enter at a lower price, it can help ensure that all 16,000 places get sold, which may not be the case if the event was only priced at £36 which would result in less revenue for the Great Bristol Run due to fewer entries. Selling all 16,000 places can therefore not only help increase the revenue of the event, but it can also create a much better atmosphere for those taking part in the race, which in turn may encourage runners to take part in the race in future years. So what we've got here, we've got a very well contextualised response which has logical chains of reasoning if we look at the context so we're talking about a lower initial price of 27 pound compared to 36 pound we're using the word runners may encourage runners so that rooted in the context we're talking about the entry price we're talking about entering the race we've got there about the 16,000 places being sold so we've got lots and lots of context we've also talked about creating a better atmosphere for those taking part in the race so we can really see how rooted this paragraph is in the overall context so it's well contextualized with logical and coherent chains of reasoning so remember in a 10 mark question we have to produce a balanced response so here we provided balance by looking at a negative impact of using penetration pricing and here we're seeing that it may result in lower race revenue the great bristol run is one of the uk's most popular mass participation sports events attracting runners from all over the country and therefore would probably sell out at the full entry price of 36 pound by offering an early bird offer of 27 pound they are losing nine pound per entry meaning that for every entry sold via the early bird offer they are missing out on nine pounds of sales revenue if all 16,000 runners entered via the early bird offer this would result in revenue of 432,000 pound compared to 576,000 pound at the full price a difference of 144,000 pound Lower sales revenue could impact on the overall profitability of the event and may impact on the viability of the Great Bristol Run in future years. So once again, we've got logical and coherent chains of reasoning and there is some really good application in this paragraph, especially using the data. So there's a recognition that for every entry sold at £27, they're going to lose £9 worth of sales revenue and we've worked out the impact that would have on overall sales revenue if everyone entered via the early bird offer. So 16,000 multiplied by the 27 pound is the 432,000 pound. And the 36 pound multiplied by 16,000 entries is the 576,000 pound. So a really good technique to try and get better application is use data in your response so if an extract contains any data then use that in your answer to support your arguments because that is a very good way of getting application so finally we need a supported judgment and remember what we said earlier in order to access the very top level of the mark scheme those nine and ten marks you have to have a supported judgment which needs to be more than just a repetition of your previous arguments so here here's our supported judgment overall i think that using penetration pricing would have a positive impact on the great bristol run as it may help ensure that the 16,000 places are filled each year and that the event sells out this may not happen if the entry fee was always 36 pound especially as it appears that the market for races is competitive as there are other half marathons which runners could enter in the surrounding areas instead of the great bristol run so here we've got our judgment 
there's context in our judgment it builds on our previous arguments but it also brings something new in. it brings in an element of mops there's a recognition that the market for races in this area is competitive therefore offering an early bird entry may encourage runners to enter this race as opposed to others and it's that end bit which really adds value to the response especially as it appears that the market for races is competitive as there are other half marathons which runners could enter in the surrounding areas instead of the great bristol run and that concludes this tutor to you edX a level business video where we've done a 10 mark question walkthrough on penetration pricing 